Okay, two, three, four. Now I know who I am. Wait. Oh yeah. I'm trying to write a song about Roundup River Ranch. It's a place that saved my spirit, and not just mine. I'm 13 years old, and I've had 74 surgeries. Sometimes I think I've missed out on a lot, and my friends here have too. But there's something about all of us that's really special. And this is a place where we can share it. We did that! Okay. You're gonna start now. Two, three, four. Alyssa hasn't had a normal childhood. She's been um, exposed to things that nobody that age should have to go through or deal with. She was born with Vactor syndrome. Her esophagus and stomach weren't hooked together. She also has a form of spinal bifida and kidney failure. Allie's medical regimen takes four hours a day, so she's had moments where she just hates me. And I tell her it's okay, you can hate me because you're breathing. <laughs> I love you and I wouldn't do this to you if I didn't have to. Abigail has had to sacrifice having me around as much as she would like because Allie's care comes first. Abigail tells me that she thinks I love her sister more than her and that kills me. You always feel torn in half because you just can't be in two places at once. I can't. Why not? I just can't. Why not? I think the hardest thing on me is that Whenever she's in the hospital or in pain or anything, that it's hard for me to like stay in normal life because you can't like be normal whenever that stuff's going on. But I am lucky to be your sister because it has made me mature more. I don't need the 24-hour attention. Well, even though I love having my mom's attention. Alyssa did say at one point that she don't want to live anymore. She was gonna spend her birthday in the hospital and she just was like, this isn't fair, mom. I just can't do this anymore, I don't wanna fight. That's actually when her doctor told us about Roundup River Ranch for the first time. We never thought anything like this was possible for our family. But then we heard that camp was free and that she would be camping with doctors and nurses in a facility that's fully prepared for anything. Before I went to Round River Ranch, I did not have any fun. I got bullied a lot. Round River Ranch really taught me that it may be hard, but I can get through it. Allie was so sad and in just a really dark place. And when she came back, it was like I had her back again. She was bubbly and she was excited and she was on fire to do things that she enjoyed. Yeah. And it's so important for them to know that they're not the only ones being challenged and that you will make it through and there are people who care and want to advocate for you. This is the first year my sisters come to camp with me. It is special having my sister here. People do think she's the older sister sometimes just because of how she takes care of me. But at camp, we're both equals for the first time. It was the first time we rode horses together, boated together, we climbed rock walls. There's a lot of times where they can't do things together because of Allie's disability, and I hate the kind of rift it causes between them. At Roundup River Ranch, they got to compete equally. They got to try new things at the same time together. They got to make new friends together. 
she's like influenced me because she's not scared and she's the brave one, which is really hard for me to accept, but she is. My mom and my sister and my dad are all definitely my heroes. And I think Ronda River Ranch changes us. It changes everything. If we didn't have that, I don't know where we would be.